Honey and Lucy. You can't hide in there forever. Fuck off! Not down there. Only one way out. Ugh. Come on, just let me kill you. Well, have someone else! Well, it can only be you, so just open the door. Well, you're gonna have to break that door down then, because I'm not going anywhere. Oh, I will. Oh, yeah? I'm gonna break down this door and kill the fucking fuck out of you. Let's go then. I'm gonna. Well? I, I, I'm working on it. Shouldn't you have, like, an axe or something? No, no. Yeah, I, I left it at home. It's for later. Later? Y you could just do it now. Shut up! When I get in there, I will fucking kill you! It's fine. It's a door. I don't understand. It's a door. I can break a door. Goddamn motherfucking bullshit! I damn! <laughs> Are you okay? No, yeah, it's fine. I just building suspense. <laughs> God, I'm so bad at this. I mean, it's okay. You don't you don't have to kill me. Yeah, right. Who else am I gonna kill? I mean, there's a retirement home down the street, and you know they're already dead, so you don't have to feel bad about it. That doesn't work for my plan for Jamie. Jamie? Like, like Jamie Lee? Yeah, no, no, no. Like, from my chem class? Yeah. Like, the, the silent, silent introverted virgin. virgin? Well, if you're in love with her so much, why don't you just go kill her then? What? No, it's just... I can't believe I have to explain this. The plan is, your death inspires her and her friends to party in the old cabin in the woods, where I kill everyone except her because she kills me. That seems stupidly long and intricate. Just come on and let me kill you. Open and kills aren't supposed to be this chatty. What did you just call me? You heard me. Open and kill. The girl who's uh, who's easy and no one cares about? That's you. Coming from the guy who can't break down a door. I'm building suspense. I bet I'm like the first person you've ever killed. No, I've killed lots of people. Okay, name one. Uh, uh, Lady, Lady D. Look, I'm sorry, you just don't seem like the killer type. Yeah, I know. It's just, it's just, it's stressful when you have to plan this all out, and when you actually go through with it... I'm sorry, I should get back to breaking down this door. No, it's okay. Take your time. I, I don't know. I just, I just kind of feel like I'm trauma dumping all my problems onto you. I mean, your problems are more interesting than others. Yeah, I guess so. What's your name, by the way? Oh, uh, the news people are supposed to give me my name after I kill everybody. Well, let's not do that. Um, how about Killy? No, Kenny. Kenny. I like that name. You know, I, I think I might have a, a basal, 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 basal syncope disease. You know, that thing where you see blood and you just freak out? I, I just, I just want to... <clears throat> Kind of ironic that a killer would be scared of blood. That's what I thought. But then I just thought, maybe if I kill them fast enough, maybe I would freak out. Is Yeah, I kind of thought it might calm you down. Is it working? You're helping a bit. Who, who is it? Oh, it's my band. Your band? Well, kinda. This is our only song. No, you don't have to downplay it. It's great. Thanks. I mean, it's only a demo, but I'm glad you like it. Yeah, if I wasn't kill you, I'd say find a studio and finish it. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Hey, look, I'm sorry. About what? I'm sorry for calling you an opening kill earlier. Oh, it's it's all good, Kenny. I just, I really wouldn't want to die. Which I respect. But I'm mainly over it. Yeah? I'm more pissed off about what's going to happen after I die. Like... I don't even know Jamie and her friends well enough, and they're going to use my death as an excuse to party? It just kind of feels like I'm being used without knowing it, you know? Yeah, you're right. But hey, to be honest, you're probably way more interesting than Jamie. True. Hey, Kenny. Yeah? What's going to happen after Jamie goes and kills you? Like, why would you want to die? Oh, to be immortal. 
immortal. Well, if it's popular, I'll rise from the grave and get a sequel where I just go from town to town killing teens. And Jamie kills me over and over again. Damn, so you have big plans. Yeah, that's why this one's gotta be good. I mean, I can see why you're overwhelmed. Maybe you're focusing too much on the big picture. Maybe it's just one person at a time. Yeah, yeah, you know what? You're right. Thank you, Lucy. That was actually pretty helpful. Of course. I feel great. I feel like I can achieve so much right now. Yeah. Be my own type of killer, none of the stereotype bullshit, but my own thing. Yeah. So does this mean I get to kill you now? Um... What's wrong? I mean, it, it's good. It's just, it's kind of off-putting. You know, you said you respected me not wanting to die, and all of a sudden... Yeah, but come on. All of this, you kind of owe me one. Owe you one? I mean, you kind of talked me into it. Well, yeah, we talked, but it doesn't mean I'm just going to fling the door open. God, you're so fucking difficult. Kenny. I talked to you about all your stupid fears of dying, and now you won't even let me kill you? Problems, I... How about this? If you open the door, I'll give you a head start. All right, that's fine. Yes, don't worry. It's gonna be the best killing of your life. All right, just let me get the locks off the door. Okay, you can come in now. Too hard. Talk to your friends.